This is a video to help you uh, set repeat links in Mobile Sheets Pro. So I've got Mobile Sheets Pro open and uh, I have a set list up here and we're going to work on this Jingle Bell Fantasy because it has a couple of repeats in it. So uh, go to your song list or your set list and open the song that you want to work on just by tapping it or clicking on it. Uh, then go, what you want to do is go to the first place uh, that a repeat begins. So in this case, we'll go um, to page 7 and you can see DS Alcoda go back to page 4. You want to click down here in the right corner, unlock Mobile Sheets Pro by clicking in the center here, and that allows your editing functions to pop up. Uh, and you get those up by clicking in the center or just tap in the center of your page and you can see the editing functions popped up all around your screen. Then go down to where you see the finger here in the bottom uh, pointing to the button. Those are your repeat links. So click on that and it brings up a box that says links and you want to add a link so you want to click on the plus sign and now Mobile Sheets is waiting for you to tell it, okay, where do I start? Well, you want to start right here at this DS Alcoda. So click right there and you see it puts a dot. Now you want to slide the pages back to where that repeat should go. And if I can get my mouse to work here to slide the page. And you need to slide the page. You can't tap the page because it'll think that's your repeat link location and that'll mess up. So you just want to do it. I'm doing this on the computer. It's a little bit more difficult with the mouse. Uh, and there's where we want the repeat to go back to, to the sign. So I click right there. That's my repeat link from page 6 to page 3. So I can close that. Then what I want to do is uh, go to the, the next place I need uh, a link. So I click here and the next page and you can see at the top of this page on page six it says when you're reading your music back through this time you're supposed to go to the coda so that's where I want the repeat to start so again I click on the pointed finger at the bottom I bring up the link box and I click on the plus mark I want to add another link and now it's saying okay well where do you want me to start okay I want to click right here at the coda and you can see it put a color dot in there and the colors are all different it, it just randomly changes the colors then I want to slide forward and there's the coda that's where I want the re repeat to go to so I click right there and boom there's my link from page 5 to 6 and then I can close this out and then um, that's the last repeat in this song. I can verify that by just going here just to the end. And you can see there are no more repeats. All right, then I can click in the center of my screen. My editing functions go away. I can click in the lower right corner and click on the lock. And that locks it back so that I don't get the editing functions. Then uh, just we'll go back and look. So I close out of Jingle Bell Fantasy and, and open it again by clicking on it. And so if you're singing along, then you can tap the right edge of your page, and you see you'll you go you can see the sign. So you know there's a repeat coming. So you need to look for it, and you're not there yet because you don't have the repeat. And uh, there it is, DS Alcoda. Uh, and if you're just using your fingers and you, know, you don't have foot pedals or anything like that, all you do is tap the dot. And if I tap that dot, it went back to the sign. Then I just simply hit the edge of the page, continue to sing. And you can see, okay, there's the second one. From here, I want to go to the coda. I simply tap the dot and the repeat link takes me to the appropriate place in the song. Um, so I hope this helps. and. Uh, I'll uh, send this video out shortly.